I'm Chef Melissa Fritz from the Culinary Institute of America in Hyde Park, New York, and I'm going to show you how you can make a delicious and healthy lemon chickpea muffin that's perfect for a quick breakfast, packing into a school lunch, or to enjoy as an after-school snack. We're going to start with our garbanzo beans, also known as chickpeas, putting that into our food processor. We also have granulated sugar, extra virgin olive oil, which is a healthier alternative to butter, egg yolks for added fat and nutrition, fresh squeezed lemon juice, fresh squeezed orange juice, lemon zest, and orange zest. So we'll proceed by adding all of these ingredients to our food processor. Now we have our beautiful chickpea paste. The benefit of using chickpeas is the added protein and fiber. I have the sugar in my bowl, and I'm going to take this puree of chickpeas and combine that with the sugar. Now I'm going to stir all of this together. Once the sugar's combined, we're going to add our sifted dry ingredients. We'll start with whole wheat flour. The benefit of using whole wheat flour is that it's not processed refined flour, so it's much healthier for you. We have our baking powder to help leaven our muffins, as well as salt to enhance the flavor. And lastly, one of the most important ingredients is our cardamom. Lemon and cardamom is a classic flavor pairing. Once all of that has been sifted in, we're going to gently fold our dry ingredients into our puree. Just until combined, you will notice that this is a very thick paste. Once that's all mixed, we'll add our almond flour. The almond flour adds a hearty, nutty flavor, as well as the benefit of more protein and fiber and healthy fats. The almond flour, you can find that at most health food stores or high-end grocery stores. All almond flour is, is ground almonds. Next, we're going to lighten this mixture. So we're going to take our egg whites and we're going to go ahead and whisk those up till they're soft peaks. Don't worry, it's not too much of an arm workout. In order to lighten the batter and help it to leaven our muffins, which just means to have them rise in the oven, we're adding the egg whites. So this, coupled with the baking powder, will give a nice rise to these muffins. Now they're at a nice soft peak, as you can see. We're going to begin by taking half of the egg whites and gently folding them into our paste. The reason I take half is because I don't want to expel the volume from my egg whites. I want the batter to stay nice and smooth. So we use half. The remaining half of the egg whites get added. And again, we're just folding lightly just to incorporate. Okay. And now we are ready to portion our muffins and get them baking. This batter does yield 12 muffins, approximately two ounces. You can grease the muffin pans or use muffin papers. When you taste these muffins, you'll only taste the lemon and the cardamom. Your children will never know that there's chickpeas in these muffins. Here we have a topping that we've created that is more cardamom with almond flour and granulated sugar. Once we've added our topping, we can put it right into the oven at 325 degrees, and we're gonna bake them for approximately 12 to 13 minutes or until they're lightly golden on top. One thing you'll notice is these muffins are not mega sized. This is a more appropriate portion size for your family in creating healthy snack options. Pair these muffins with fresh fruit and yogurt for a hearty breakfast or grab a muffin for a satisfying snack. Thanks for watching. Thank you.